Hi, Gian. Gian, I can't hear you. I said that this is a trial, okay? I'm just trying now. And I'll be starting okay. in, in about five minutes time, okay? Yeah, okay, no worries. I'll, at seven at seven o'clock, I'll be back at seven o'clock, okay? So I'm just <laughs> doing a trial and you are there and you are seeing me doing the trial, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. See you soon, see you soon. Yeah.
Hello, everyone. Hello, Gian. Good evening. Good evening. Now, I say that let's, Good evening, wait. John. let's wait for another minute, another minute, from two to three minutes or whatsoever, because maybe someone else would like to come in to the meditation. Okay. Okay. Yes. Buongiorno, Gian. Buongiorno, buongiorno. Buonasera, Choi. <laughs> buonasera. Okay, I can already see familiar faces. There is even someone from Italy as well. C'è anche qualcuno dall'Italia. So I will have to do some fast translation as well in layman terms. Dovrei fare qualche traduzione veloce in termini rapidi, rapidi, rapidi. Okay. Comunque, anyway, let's start the evening, okay? And what we will be doing this evening? Cosa faremo stasera? What will we be doing? Okay, this evening will be an online shaman evening based upon a breathing technique, okay? Since I'm going to do this online, I don't want to go too heavy on you guys, okay? So I'm not going to do the... The, the, let's say the breathing technique of the fire of life, for an example, which is this. Because without my assistance with this breathing technique, if you go in hyperventilation and you are behind your computer and you're on your own and you're not used to this breathing technique, hyperventilation may make your head turn initially and you may faint behind the computer. And where is Giancarlo to assist you in this case? long, far away from your home, okay? So since we are online, I would like to do a breathing exercise, a breathing modality, which is a very powerful cleansing modality and very valid the same, but it is lighter as a breathing modality, okay? And it doesn't create the hyperventilative effect as the direct, let's say, fire of life breathing, which is this. So it's not recommendable to do this for a long time online. Otherwise, yes, I won't be there to assist you if you faint, okay? And if there is someone here that isn't used to meditation or hasn't ever done a breathing technique meditation, you are doomed. No, I'm only kidding. Don't take me seriously, okay? It will be a very beautiful experience, okay? I've studied this for, I've, I've, I've studied this in a way that it will be a beautiful, gentle, but powerful online experience. So where are we going? Anyway, for who doesn't know me yet, allow me to present myself fastly because let's go into the work, of course, okay? We are here to do some spiritual work, okay? To cleanse ourselves profoundly, to purge all the negativities out of ourselves and to step into our power of positivity. Are you ready? Yes. Anyway. A brief explanation for who I am. You can even do this while I'm explaining myself. Okay, you can even fall asleep because this is the boring part. Okay. Anyway, as usual, my name is Giancarlo Zazzeri, and for who doesn't know me, I'm a metaphysicist, a shaman, and a senior holistic practitioner. And I'm here to give my light service to each one of you. Okay, for your spiritual growth, your spiritual wellness, but especially to help your souls to walk on their feet. Yes, to walk on the feet of your souls, okay? And this is what counts, claiming back your power. Hmm? Because we are living in the year 2021. And we are living a very particular period, which is the war against the consciousness. Mm -hmm. So who we are really? We are consciousness. We are one. We are love. We are one with unconditional and infinite powerful love of the whole. We are source and we transcend into human beings. And through this transcendental process, we develop an intelligence. And if this intelligence is connected to the heart, it becomes wisdom. 
And now we have the key to master our destiny. We are authentically ourselves. And this is how we should be in 2021, okay? We should be winners of ourselves, right? Okay. Now let's explain the breathing technique. Now, there, beyond the, 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 the modality, which is the hard way, which is where you are sending air into your tummy, okay? Down right into your tummy and bringing it back up with your nostrils. There is another breathing technique that goes like this, another shaman breathing technique that goes like this, which is safe to teach online, okay? Which goes like this. But you have to even do some body movements. You have to you move your shoulders as well. So it's when you breathe in, you breathe in twice with your nostril and you breathe out with the mouth that you still have to send the air down deep into the bowels, into the tummy, okay? It's breathing with the tummy. Okay? But when you breathe in twice, you have to move your shoulders as well, upward, like this. This is a breathing technique that I use when I do my trance guidance, okay? My trance dance modality. Trance dance is a modality where you do this breathing technique standing up and you do it in darkness or with your eyes blindfolded, okay? And for this modality, you enter into contact with the, with the power spirit, with the power animals, the spirit animal guides, okay? And you're in the dark doing this and you're starting to move your body, you're starting to dance, you're starting to go into some sort of spiritual groove modality, okay? Okay, but this time we can do it sitting down, okay? But important is doing this. Have I been clear? Simple? Very, very good. Are there any questions? No questions at all? Okay, then. I'm going to initially guide you into a profound state of relaxation, okay? Where you'll go into a beautiful place in nature, under a starry sky, an enchanted forest, the realm of the spirit animals, the power animals, okay? And with this breathing modality, we are going to work with four power animals. The power animal of the north, which is the wolf. The wolf resembles the virtue of non-attachment, the first virtue of the soul, a fundamental step, non-attachment, okay? Where you're above, let's say, um, where you are, you have, let's say, a certain amplified vision of the whole. You are non-judgmental, you are in the state of non-attachment, you are neutral, and this means even compassion. Then we have the power animal of the East, which is the horse. Okay. And the horse is free will. Okay. Free will. You're free to take your own choices and you're riding your choice. Okay. Free will. And this is the second virtue of the soul. These are reawakening keys. And then we have the power animal, the South. It is the buffalo, and this is the warrior, buffalo warrior, okay, in the heart of America, yeah. Remember that song? It was Bob Marley's song, buffalo soldier in the heart of America. And Tatanka, sitting bull, he, were, he resembles the buffalo, okay. He is a very important Indian chief. He's a warrior, great warrior. And this is courage and determination, okay. And then we have the spirit animal of the West the healer. But healing means self-responsibility, taking care of yourself, self-love, self-value, and this is the bear, okay? And then the very center, the unifying force of these four virtues, the unifying force, when these four forces work together, then they connect us to the great spirit, the eagle, the golden and silver eagle. So what is it? What are we going to do? 
We are going to manifest these four power animals through meditation. They're going to be like dancing lights, like an aurora borealis dancing in the sky and then vortexing around us. And then they will enter our heart and manifest the great spirit, the eagle, which will expand its light. And from there we will start. But with what? With my shaman music. You see this, the drum? Okay. And this instrument, which is called the didgeridoo. It is a the audio stopped for some reason. The Aborigines of Australia. Okay. It is the father and the mother of all shaman healing instruments. The tradition goes way back to 60,000 years. That's why I personally consider it the father and the mother of all shaman sound healing instruments, okay? And they will be here on my throat chanting. Non ti sento, non ti sento. Okay, so there will be even my throat chanting as well, okay? So now let's start the meditation. Of course, it's very difficult to have a good sound quality when you are playing your instruments live behind the computer. So I've created some sort of setup where there's a stool and I'm going to put the didgeridoo on the stool and hopefully the sound will come out, okay? But let's have a little try, okay? Let's have a little try to see if the sound of the didgeridoo is perfectly heard, okay? sound of the didgeridoo perfect very good that means that i did well to create this setup okay otherwise the sound comes and goes well let's start then okay may we start our journey into ourselves through this let's say Gentle but powerful shaman breathing, okay? I'm going to stay here, this way. Wait a minute. Who has written in the chat? Okay, perfect. Now, all you have to do is follow my initial guidance. Otherwise, you are doomed. No, I'm only kidding. All you have, now, just relax yourself. All you have to do is follow my initial guidance where you will close your eyes only when I tell you to do so. So now keep your eyes open. Relax your shoulders. Relax your arms. And while keeping your eyes open, take five deep breaths because five is the number of divine connection and transcendence. Once your eyes are closed, just listen to your calm and gentle breathing, which is like the gentle breeze of the autumn or spring wind in the woods, vortexing around you, giving you a sensation of peace and stillness and tranquility in your heart. which is rising and vortexing gently into your mind to calm your mind and to blow away all your thoughts, stress and tension, like clouds being blown away in the sky, drifting away and disappearing on the horizon. 
Now imagine yourself in a beautiful enchanted forest. Under this sky where your thoughts are drifting away like clouds and dissolving away. This is the realm of the spirit animals. The power animals. And gently, gently, the sky is becoming darker. The sun is going down and disappearing beyond the horizon, behind the trees. And the stars appear in the sky. Millions and trillions of stars forming the Milky Way. And in that beautiful clear sky, you can see dancing lights, the aurora borealis, generating your favorite colors, the colors of your soul, but even assuming shapes and forms, the spirit animal. You can see the wolf running in the sky with these beautiful colors the power animal of non-attachment, the power animal of compassion. And running behind the wolf, you can see the horse, running and playing together with the horse, the spirit animal of free will. And together with the horse and the wolf, you see the buffalo running in the sky with its beautiful luminous colors, the warrior, courage and determination, standing tall and proud. And together with the buffalo, the horse and the wolf, the bear, self-care, taking care of yourself, giving value to yourself. This is the key to healing. And now, connect yourself to your heart. Imagine to see your heart as a beautiful crystal temple, like a flower opening up towards the sky, towards the crown chakra. And at the same time, feel your crown chakra opening up like a beautiful crystal flower. And the beautiful colors of the power animals of this aurora borealis vortexing downwards through your crown chakra and entering your heart where you have these spirits now running and dancing and vortexing in your heart manifesting the great spirit in the very center an eagle of light made of gold and silver expanding from the very center of your heart throughout your body where you are losing the perception of the shape of your body because you are becoming the great spirit. You are the great spirit, rising in the sky, expanding its wings, embracing the universe and ready to breathe the pure energy of all the cosmos, the energy of oneness, the energy of pure love and peace. And to be this oneness, Eternally breathing the breath of life throughout all dimensions. Listen to how I am breathing. Do the same thing. You will breathe in twice with your nostril and send the air under the umbilical. And then breathe out with your mouth once. Following the rhythm of the drum, the heartbeat of the universe. Together with the celestial music of the stars, the chant of creation itself, the sound of the dream times. <laughs>
continue following the rhythm of the heartbeat of the universe.
gently slow down the breathing. Slow down the breathing. And stop breathing in a calm and gentle way. And feel the stillness and the calmness and the peace within. The stillness and the calmness around. Feel the presence of the spirit animals around you and within your heart as the light of the great spirit expands from your heart throughout your body and beyond. Touching all the stars, stretching out and reaching out towards the whole universe. You are the whole, you are the one, you are consciousness, the divine consciousness. Always remember this in every moment of your life, every footstep, any circumstance that you live in. Remember this always.
Spread out your wings of light towards the earth, towards humanity. Expand the light of your consciousness of pure love, the great spirit, to all of the world. Embrace the world with your wings, the wings of the great spirit which is you. Embrace humanity, embrace the children, embrace the middle-aged people, embrace the elders, embrace the young ones. May the light of the Great Spirit enter their hearts to bring light and clarity and wisdom, divine wisdom into their minds, to live their pathway in the most authentic of ways, together as one, we are all one, we are all love, we are one, we are great spirit. Spread out your light towards the animals, towards the land, the sea, the sky, the ground, the plants. contemplate this moment. Go back to the place where this journey has begun, into the heart of the enchanted forest. Where you are assuming your human form, that the light of the Great Spirit forever shines within your heart throughout your hour. and feel the sounds echoing within your heart of the spirit animals. The wolf, non-attachment. The horse, free will. The buffalo, courage and determination. The bear, self-care. The four fundamental keys to be constantly connected and to transcend into who you are, the great spirit that walks in a human body, that lives under the ground, that swims in the oceans, that flies in the sky, and that lives in its stillness, as all the plants and the trees and the flowers, and that drifts wherever the wind takes it as clouds. It is the wind itself. You are all of this, and all of this is within you. And beyond the stars, the galaxies, the universe. The mystery of the unknown, the infinite. Contemplate this moment.
in silence. The silence is the language of love and peace. And now, connect to your breathing. Feel your breathing in a calm and gentle way. Start to move the fingers of your hands and the toes of your feet. Feel your heart beating and the blood circulation. Be grateful for who you are. You are just a partial existence of the Great Spirit. And now take five deep breaths. And after the fifth breath, you can gently open your eyes with the most beautiful smile on your face. And once your eyes are open, just remain for an instance still in silence. Because one fundamental thing in spirituality is learning to contemplate existence in silence. Which is contemplating yourself. And this is the way to divine connection with the whole. And here we are. I'm still going to wait for a few minutes so that I give the time for all of you to be back in the here and now, okay? For who's already back, drink some water, okay? Because it's very important to drink water after this type of experience. After all sorts of spiritual experiences, even from the lightest of all meditations, water, always ready to be drunk. It helps to ground, okay? And drinking water helps to stay focused as well. Very well, very well. I can feel a very good energy that has been generated from tonight's, let's say, shaman breathing and sound meditation. The animal spirits are roaming around each one of you. And tonight you will sleep with the spirit animals and fly like an eagle, the great spirit in the sky. So, yes, how is everyone? Would someone like to share their experience? 
don't feel obliged by the way okay if you feel like sharing you, your experience fine okay otherwise it's good the same the important is keeping the memory of the experience in the heart so if anyone wants to share their experience that's fine okay if anyone wants to ask any questions it's okay the same hmm? yes okay Eve, what's the what's the what what would hello. You like? yeah. hello john thank you so much for this i woke up to this since i'm in sedona which is in arizona in the states and i i had a beautiful sleep and i didn't sleep i slept less than usual but i had a very Pacific sleep, knowing that I was going to wake up to this and knowing you, what you do and how this is. <laughs> and this is a new experience of this because I went through all the spiritual realms since I started meditating, which was back in 1996. But going through being still a drinker of alcohol and all that stuff, near death experience, blah, blah, but every experience and every animal that came through my meditational experiences since then have come through okay I, I can't, okay and in sedona the energy is fervently more amplified in sedona as well that's a sacred yes. place <laughs> very powerful yes Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you for the he, for the sharing. Oh, and I understand that Joe <laughs> wants to share something. Okay, you're waving your hand. No, no, I'm good. You're good. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Nothing compared from last uh, last night, no. But it's good. Last okay. night was really great. I mean. Um, I've been meditating almost, what, uh, 45, 40, 45 years. Nothing like that. But it's great. <laughs> yes. Very good, very good. Great experience. Okay, then. If no one else has anything to share, it's fine the same. I perfectly know that you've all... Lynn, okay. Yes, you've raised your hand. Yeah, uh, I have. I want to share. It was a very powerful uh, meditation today, the shaman. And then so toward the end, uh, when we slow down the breathing, and then you were doing the the the, the throat chanting, I start crying. <laughs> I was crying nonstop, and then so I don't know why it was very sad a part of me. Then after after a while then I become very calm and relaxing. And I, my body was very hot and my palm is like very warm as well during the, throughout the meditation. It was very strong voltage. Well, that was a very beautiful healing. Okay, this crying, I feel that it's something that comes from a past life, some sort of unresolved issue. And you are letting go of this karma and now you're going to feel much better i'm sure okay okay mm -hmm. because i feel that you are in the constant research of inner peace mm -hmm. yes for inner peace especially for the everyday life that you're living and being surrounded by people who have their own energies but yes now you're going to be more self-centered okay Okay. Very Thank nice. you so much. You're Thank welcome. you. You're welcome. Mario. Thank you, John. Yes. I know you, Mario. I know you. <laughs> okay. Thank you to everyone. I can see people writing. And what can I say? I am here in Dubai until the 21st of February. Okay, and then I'll be finishing my, let's say, my period of 
sessions and teachings for the moment, the 21st of February. So to remind you all that as of, of Dubai, I'm not local and I don't come here very often, Lee. So if you want to get to see me to have a half an hour consult and then even a one hour consult, okay, I'm here, okay. It's an open door or let's say the golden train is passing now and it stopped at the station of Dubai and it's about to leave the 21st. So if you want one session at least, okay, to try one session, it's spiritual reset. I'm taking you back to the light. It's going to be a washing machine for your soul and you're coming back reborn, reborn, spiritually reborn, okay? So if you want to chuck your soul into the cosmic washing machine of the supreme divine energy, come to me for one hour and it's, yes, you're gonna get it, <laughs> okay? And my experiences, people who have experience with me, yes, I have to say that they have life-changing experiences, okay? It's not because I'm talking about myself because I'm simply speaking out the truth, okay? So don't miss out on my presence until the 21st, okay? Because then the train will then go to other places and who knows when will it come back again, okay? So if you feel ready to make a step into your spiritual growth and to know yourself better and to understand what authenticity is all about, I'll be here at Illuminations, okay? And I'll be even guiding a meditation on the spot next week, okay? On the spot next week for Dubai people. And I don't remember if it's Tuesday or Wednesday or Monday. Anyway, you can contact Illuminations and they will tell you exactly when, when my last meditation on the spot will be. It's my last meditation on the spot. So please don't miss out, okay? And it will be a meditation with the angels, okay? We're going to, let's say, fix ourselves up with the energies of the archangels, okay? Because shamans do work with the archangels, okay? Being a shaman doesn't mean that you're working only with herbs or the spirit animals or the elementals, okay? Being shaman means that you are working with all types of spirits, the celestials, the angels, and the spirits of the nature as well, okay? So it's, let's say, that's how it is, okay? So what can I say? Thank you everyone for your participation and may Thank the great spirit accompany you tonight. In your Once room. again, yeah. Thank you very much again. Thank you, Gracias. ladies. Thank so, you, Jean. And I Thank honor you. your presence and I honor the spirit in each one of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And may Thank all of you shine in your existence, the shine of the light of authenticity, the light of being truthful with yourself. Okay. Hmm? Thank you, John. Thank and you, many John. blessings of you. Many blessings. Thank you. Thank you, John. Thank you. Potremo, potremo parlare un attimo dopo? Okay. Bye bye.